In 2021, NJM and Children's Hospital of Philadelphia announced a multi-year partnership to roll out the state-of-the-art virtual driving assessment program at CHOP primary care locations in New Jersey and Pennsylvania. NJM provided a $4 million grant to support this groundbreaking effort. NJM Consumer Safety Director, Violet Marrero, and Founder and Co-Scientific Director of the Center for Injury Research and Prevention, Dr. Flora Winston, discussed the merits of this innovative program and their collaboration to advance the future of teen driver safety. When I think about what we have accomplished in teen driver safety, you know, we reach parents, we reach teens, we educate them, we empower them with the information and the resources that they need. But we don't offer them the critical component of it, which is a, an assessment that t literally tells them what their young driver's weaknesses are. I'm a researcher. We're all researchers in the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia or clinicians. But if we want to reach a very large population, we need to partner. And to partner with an insurance company like NJM has really been just a thrill for me because of the reach that you have. So I can find ways to improve things for families. I can find how children and teens crash when they're in cars. But to actually get this to scale, to make a difference, I need a partner. And we have one. Crashes have been the leading, uh, a leading cause of death for adolescents for decades now. And, you know, the most exciting thing about this partnership to me is the potential that it has in terms of changing the way that we look at teen driver safety from, you know, as, from a safety professional perspective. We care about our adolescents. We know that adolescents need better care. And so driving is important to the teens, it's important to the families, and it's a life threat. So we are the first clinical practice in the world that is making driving assessment part of our standard care. We looked at the most common serious crash scenarios and we looked at the skills that you need to avoid them and we put it into a virtual assessment. And that virtual assessment is safe, reliable, and takes you through the paces of some of these serious crash scenarios to see if you can handle them. The first time that I saw the assessment report and how comprehensive it was in terms of laying out the specific deficits and their skills behind the wheel, I was just blown away because it, uh, it's the missing link because what we really want to see is research in action, right? And we want to make sure that parents have what they need to protect their children because every child should arrive home safely and that's, you know, why we're here. If families really want to make a difference with this, they really have to understand that the number one highest period of time in your entire life for getting into a car crash is right after a teen gets a license. The idea that you can go to your doctor and get assessed for your driving makes perfect sense to people. That's going to be the magic of the future. I hope that our policyholders and everyone that they share the roads with will be safe because their teens have been empowered with this tremendous tool that's going to allow them to really make sure that their young driver is safe on the roads and gets home safe.